We must collect the index before we can activate the installation. Oh, I really, really do not feel like playing this level. <laughs> this level easily goes down as the worst Halo level of all time. Out of any of the Halo games, this is the worst level they have ever made. And it is just legitimately not fun and legitimately bad. And uh, any Halo player will understand. And looking in hindsight, I probably should have turned this on easy so I could just blow through this level because it really is not fun. Fighting the Flood is not fun, and I've always said this about Halo, the Flood really, really does ruin the game. The flood is just not fun to fight in any of the Halo games. Now, they, the Flood became less bad in uh, the later Halo levels, or later Halo games. Like, after every single Halo game, like, Halo 2's wasn't as bad as Halo 1's, Halo 3's wasn't as bad as Halo 2's. Uh, and then Halo 3 ODST, and then uh, Reach, it didn't have Flood in at all. So, you know, that's probably what made them the most well-rounded game single-player-wise, because if you think about it, every Halo game, Halo 1, 2, and 3 had some bad levels. Now, they they kind of flushed it out as time goes along. They made them a little bit better. Halo 1 had some terrible levels and some really good levels. Halo 2 is this, the exact same. Some levels were just plain not fun, and other, other levels were really fun. Halo 3 became a little bit more balanced. Some levels were still pretty damn bad, though. And then once the flood disappeared, the, the games became pretty even all the way through. Like, I can't really think of a level that was legitimately bad in ODST or in Halo Reach. I really can't. And they were they were all pretty, I would say, kind of mediocre, honestly. Um, none of the games were bad. They were a little bit above average when it comes to shooters, but lately that's honestly not too hard with the way shooters have been the last few years. The last ten years, I would say. But yeah, in general, it's just sort of interesting at how bad this level is, and... People would regard this game as one of the best shooters of all time. I wouldn't go that far in any way whatsoever. Uh, Halo 1 was a, a great game, don't get me wrong. Uh, but I, it, in my opinion, it can't rival other single-player games like uh, Half-Life 1 or something along those lines that are really that good. Holy shit explosion. I probably should have turned this on easy. Get away from me with that shotgun. In fact, give me that shotgun. This will make my life easier. I dropped my pistol to get rid of these stupid flood things. But yeah, it's interesting. People would regard this game as one of the best games of all time. I wouldn't go that far, like I said. Single player wise, it, it was okay. Uh, it's, it's something about it is addicting, but it, it was influential. I wouldn't say it was innovative, but it definitely influenced a lot of games. Fuck off. It definitely influenced a lot of games. It, I don't think it really made anything new, but it definitely influenced them. Um, but it's just interesting to see one of, quote-unquote, the best games of all time have one of, quote-unquote, one of the worst levels of all time. And this is the whole point of the fucking level, to get that thing right there. I am standing 15 feet away from where I need to go to complete this level. The index can, or the, the oracle can just fucking fly around and pick it up and give it to me. But I have to go up every single one of these levels. You can see all the levels I have to go up, and it's just never-ending non-stop flood the whole time, which is not fun to fight, and they continuously spawn enemies, which is just never do that in a video game. Never continuously spawn enemies. That's terrible. So yeah, I, I can really rant all day long about how bad this game, is, or this level is. Not this game, just this level. Never-ending flood. Random rocket launcher deaths a lot. When you turn a corner, fuck off. And I'm playing on Heroic, if you are wondering. <laughs> so I'm going to be doing a lot of just running through, not actually trying to fight them. And you know, I think the reason that a lot of people consider this game to be one of their favorite games of all time is because this is a lot of people's childhood game. Uh, the next generation up that grew up on the Xbox and with that generation, they didn't have another shooter to look back at. This was like the first legitimately good shooter that was on the original Xbox. So they didn't have anything to compare it to. That's all they had played. So of course, you know, they say it's the best game of all time and little did they know another game called Half-Life 1 came out forever before that. Um, actually, just few few years, three or four years before that, that was ultimately better. 
And I will continuously to talk about Half-Life 1 because, I mean, when you talk about the best shooter of all time, you have to mention Half-Life 1. There's no way not to. Who had that shotgun? Thought I just got shot with a shotgun. But yeah, to sum it up, what this, uh, the reason this level is so bad, four or five floors that are copy-pasted look the same the whole way through, never-ending enemies of Flood, which are not fun to fight and very frustrating and irritating and annoying. Um, that, that pretty much sums it up right there. It's just very repetitive. The enemies are not fun. It's very boring. Yeah. I, I could rant forever about how bad this level really is. Give me that shotgun ammo. Ah! Oh. Overshield. Ow, fuck off with that shotgun. I need more shotgun ammo. This, this installation's research facilities are most impressive. No, he dropped the shotgun. Ouch. Yeah, leave me alone. Damn it. Why are you still alive? Damn it, where did that shotgun go? There we go, 13 rounds for a shotgun. Oh, jeez. There we go. I need some health. There's no way this level could get any worse. Why are you... T it's like walking sideways. Ouch. You know, I really respect 343 for remaking this game and not changing a damn thing. But this is a level that I really wish they did change. Perhaps maybe add in something that allows you to entirely skip it if you don't want to play it. <laughs> Flood activity has caused a failure in a and let me give you an idea of how much worse this level was like the fact that the graphics aren't as bad now as they were back in the day uh, actually somewhat helps this level because at least it doesn't look like total shit it looks a little less copy and paste but it still looks the same all the way through give me that shotgun ammo I need it Well, I was going to switch to the original graphics, but I kind of can't do that while I'm getting spammed with enemies. Get out of here. Oh, dear lord. Oh god, I hear one of the guns glitching into the wall. Alright. Still alive. Hoodoop. I'm gonna go have to get out of here. 
Get out of here. Gonna have to go ahead and change that. Alright, where'd that shotgun? Dear lord. <laughs> Ow. Stop it. I'm having fun. Jeez, flutter all about ruining your fun. At least they had shotguns. Hey, it has no arms. Oh, it does have an arm. That's how much I hate you. <laughs> God, that's terrifying. Alright, where's the checkpoint? So if I die, I can... I can guarantee you I will die at one point this level. I want a pistol right now, damn it. I miss the range of this shotgun. I really, really do. Also, Halo 1. The range of the shotgun outranges the assault <laughs> rifle. That logic weapons to manage the flood only for a short time speed is of the essence no give me that shotgun ammo of course the shotgun had to land in a corner Yeah, let me show you how bad this level used to look. This is why I hate this level. It looked like this from start to finish. Just... Dear God, it was so bad, and I have more levels to go to. Also, I forgot the terminal. There is a terminal on one of these floors. Pretty sure it was not the first one. Gotta go up here. Come on. Yeah, I think it was the uh, the third floor. At least I'm pretty sure it was. And can you how much better? How much better? Can you imagine how much better the Halo series would be if it didn't have flood at all? Bugs are really annoying. Huh. What? I miss being able to melee those. Like, you couldn't do that after Halo 1. What?
Yeah, what? It was like stuck in the wall. Things are the most irritating enemies. That should help. Whoa, jeez. Whoa! No, drop that rock launcher. In fact, actually, give me that. Give me the rocket launcher. Oh, fuck the rocket launcher. You pretty much have to rush through because the flood it never stopped. Okay, bye. Have fun. No, you get off. There we go. What? Because fuck you. Look how they just kind of looked at it. any health but I got ammo so I'm good I picked up this pistol because there there are flood to carry rocket launchers and I don't want to step anywhere near them because they'll just kill both of us I got chuck an aim out of that. Thought so, wrong way to go. Get away from me with that shotgun. I'm just gonna go ahead and keep going. Okay, bye. Go fight the uh, the sentinels. Don't fight me. Stop it. Oh right. One of these stupid areas where I have to hold off at a fucking door. Holy shit. Oh, get away, get away. Look at all the tiny little bugs. Er.
Why does a shotgun outrange every other weapon possible? Holy shit. going for the the terminal on this level you can see it over there it's a yellow glowing thingy the only good thing about this level is that it requires me to do almost no editing whatsoever don't need to turn down the audio in most places I don't need to turn it up there's like two cutscenes start in the end and then this terminal Guarding a weapon with no targets. A weapon I could tune to any target. This is not what I had in mind when I volunteered. Not what I had in mind at all. I was naive to think I understood what this installation meant. We were all so naive. Looking back, we should have done a few things differently. For one thing, we should have installed two caretakers for installation. Because I am alone, I am losing focus. And that is very, very dangerous for a system such as myself. Perhaps a visit to the nearby gas giant is in order. My impulse drives could certainly make the journey. A few hundred years of travel might do me some good. There it was again. How very unproductive of me. It seems strange that the librarian did not account for this. Her strength was always in planning and positioning the pieces and then being bold enough to let it happen. To let her plans come true. I was a part of many of those plans long before I knew for certain that she was real. Before any of us were. But at the end, we had only a fragment of her brilliance left to us. And I fear that she did not fully appreciate the nature of my situation here. The problems it might pose. But even a fragment of... Fragment? Fragment, yes. Oh dear, here it comes again. I wonder if there's anything else over here. Or if just a random area they had put. I wonder what it looks like in the original. Just a random room with no point at all. Can I access the terminal that's not there still? Nope. I have to turn it back to these graphics. Then I can. I was pushing X. I actually tried to even though it did wouldn't let me. So I noticed something when I was editing the last video. So let me switch back to the original graphics real quick. Alright, so look at my thumb. My thumb, for the most part, it, it looks okay. It looks perfectly fine. Now let me switch back to this graphics. Oh dear god. <laughs> His thumb is like ridiculously long and just is bent in a way that shouldn't be possible. Oh, I almost just fell. <laughs> Oops, wrong button. Damn it. I meant to turn off the flashlight and push the light for some reason. Oh, hello. The installation was specifically built to study and contain the fun. Their survival as a race was dependent upon it. I am grateful to see that some of them survived to reproduce. Oh dear God! Fuck off! Oh, I hit one of the stupid bugs.
What? Now you're supposed to wait here and fight Flood until he opens the door. <laughs> but you can actually just hide in this corner away from all of them. And then run away, because the Sentinels will be there when the door opens. So I'm just going to go ahead and hide in this corner over here. <laughs> you're never going to be able to unsee how Master Chief's thumb is bent in ways it shouldn't be. You really can't. I also can't unsee how there's no bullet in the chamber on the pistol. Like, they really, really should have added it. It really looks like they tried to make it a closed chamber, which just makes me even more annoyed because, uh... What point is that? That's not gonna do any good. You won't be able to unclear any jams. Also, beside that, how would you eject casings? Like, where do the casings go? How does that work? Okay, bye. I'm gonna keep going. T keep close. Fuck you. I'm gonna keep running. Oh shit, never mind. Holy shit, ow. I cannot tell you the amount of times random explosions like that have almost gotten me killed. Did that one just fall over dead as soon as it hit the ground? I didn't even shoot it. Okay, bye. I'm out. I like the noise it makes when you throw a grenade. Completely out of grenades, that's bad. Thank you for the shotgun ammo. <laughs> the 
Holy shit! Oh, you get away! God damn it! <laughs> oh, fucking did not want to push select. If that one stupid flood didn't show up out of nowhere, I would have been perfectly fine and survived that. Right at the end of the fucking level, I die for the first time. Like, I really cannot describe how much dying in this level is fucking irritating. In general, I just can't describe how much this level sucks. The amount of not fun cannot be described. I am going to die again. Okay, I'm out. Fuck your shit. God damn it. I'm right at the end of the fucking level. Give me a fucking checkpoint. God damn. Checkpoint! Thank you! Fuck you, level! Hey, can't kill me now, fuckers! How do you like that, motherfucker? Take possession of the index for transport. Your organic form renders you vulnerable to infection. The index must not fall into the hands of the flood before we reach the control room and activate the installation. The flood is spreading. We must hurry. 